The Asante people of Ghana use the term Sankofa, which means go back to the past in order to build for the future. This idea represents the concept of self-identity and collective identity of the larger cultural group. Some Hampton University students have an awareness of their family history. Ohio. My dad's side of the family is from Georgia. My mother's from Jamaica. Like Philadelphia. Texas. Nationality-wise, we're German, Native American, and black. As I know my family's been in North Carolina for generations, going back to my grandfather and my great-grandfather, but that's pretty much as far back as I know. While others don't. I would actually like to know um, what country we came from, um, when we came to the United States. I know I'm mixed with some type of Anglo, but I don't know where they're from. I want to know for sure what type of Indian I'm mixed with. I know that you know my family doesn't come from you know the United States. I would like to know you know what tribe I come from. Without the knowledge of their history, many African Americans in the diaspora have a sense of disconnect to their ancestors. We have our last names from somebody else and we were traded along whatever lines that were mixed. Like, so there's a bit of confusion in our race as far as where we come from. The film Banished explores the struggle faced when African Americans of today seek closure for the injustice faced by their ancestors of yesterday. Like the Asante, Hampton students recognize the importance of knowing their ancestry. If you don't know where you're from, you can't know where you're going. You really can't know where you're going unless you know where you've been. Because if you don't know where you come from, you don't know where you're going. You can't know where you're going unless you know where you came from. I'm Simone Herndon reporting for HU360.